This is another update, another mighty model, which is small in size. Is this really worth it? Is it easy to set up in your local computer? That's exactly what we're going to see today. Let's get started. We are going to use text generation web UI for this. To set up text generation web UI, git clone text generation web UI and click enter and navigate to that folder. After that, type bash start macOS.sh. If it's Linux or Windows, type that accordingly and then click enter. Now you are able to navigate to text generation web UI using this URL. Now I am in the text generation web UI. In there, you can click the model at the top. Then you can enter your model name here and the file name here and click the download button. This should automatically download the model and it'll say done. Once that is done, you should be able to refresh at the top icon and then at the drop down, you can click the Zephyr 7 billion parameter model and then click load and then you should be able to save the settings. Once that is ready, now we can go to the chat tab at the top and click the chat. Here we can give basic arithmetic operation. Let's ask what's 5 plus 3. 5 plus 3 equals 8. That's correct. As a context awareness test, if it's raining, should you take an umbrella? Absolutely yes. It is advisable to carry an umbrella when weather forecast indicates rainfall. That's good. Next logical reasoning. If all roses are flowers, are all flowers or roses? No, not necessarily. That's the right answer. Next Python program. Write a Python function to find the factorial of 5. Now we got a program. Call the function with the argument 5 and print the result. That seems right. Next as a general knowledge question. Who is the Prime Minister of the UK in 2012? David Cameron. That's right. So yeah, that's the basic test, but I'll be performing some advanced tests, the upcoming large language models. So stay tuned. I hope you like this video. Do like, share and subscribe and thanks for watching.